Irieites, me and Persis. Fins to the left. Fins to the left. And let's go this way. Come on. Come on. Get in the car. We're going to Key West. Nope, nope. You don't have to call anybody. Don't go get nothing. We'll get stuff when we're there. We're going. Get in the car. Just get in the car. Don't think about it. Don't, don't look at your phone. Get in the car. We're going down to Key West. Where I come from in Beaverton, Oregon, it rains all the time. And on days like today, when it's freezing outside, we had what we call parrot head parties. Parrot head, shoulders, knees, and toes, to be exact. And um, Jimmy Buffett, <laughs> you had to call, <laughs> call and call. At my head, shoulders, knees, and toes. <clears throat> Get to the fun shit. <laughs> so today, we're going to pay tribute to the King Hell Troubadour of all time, the Mick Jagger of Troubadours, the man, the myth, the legend, the sailor, the author, the actor, the um, humanitarian. And uh, this song, what a story, what a story he has. His father and his grandfather were sailors on the coast, uh, off the coast of Alabama. Um, at a certain point, he went down to New Orleans and started busking on the street. That's when you take a hat and you put it on the ground. The oldest, second oldest occupation in the world. And um, can you imagine being 1970 and you're walking through uh, New Orleans French Quarter and there's a kid busking and you don't know it, but it's Jimmy Buffett. And a couple uh, blocks down, Jerry Jeff Walker's doing the same thing. And they're becoming friends. And at a certain point, Jerry Jeff Walker started making records. And right after that, Jimmy started making records. Jerry made a few records and felt burned out by the whole thing. And so he went all the way down to Key West to get his head together, and then he went back to Austin. Not long after that, this is the best I know it. This is probably marginally true, but not, not long after that, Jimmy was had about two records in, and he was burned out. Um, and so Jerry Jeff said, I got the perfect idea. And Jerry Jeff drove him in an old Packard, from what I understand, and he took him down. At this time, a Key Largo was the famous key, you know. Everybody went to Key Largo. Um, and Jerry Jeff drove Jimmy down there, and they stayed for a while. And when Jerry Jeff took off, Jimmy did not. It was his place. He was a sailor. He'd found his home. And he started singing in the bars, and he started developing this Calypso Caribbean rock thing. Fingers Taylor was down there. Keith Sykes was down there. Um, it was going to be undeniable. He met a young Jane who he'd, he would marry. And um, eventually he would make records for MCA. And on the, I want to say the very first one had this song on it. I think it was White Sport Coat and a Pink Crustacean was the first one. Francisco, for Labor Day weekend show. I've got my hush puppies on. I guess I never was meant for glitter rock and roll. And honey, I didn't know that I'd be missing you so. But come Monday, it'll be alright. Come Monday, 
I'll be holding you tight. I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. Yes, it's been quite a summer. Rent cars and westbound trains. And now you're off on vacation. Something that you tried to explain. Oh, darling, since I love you so, that's the reason I just had to go. But a come on day, it'll be all right. A come on day. I'll be holding you tight. I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. I can't help it, honey. You're that much a part of me now. Remember that night in Montana when we said there'd be no room for doubt. I hope you're enjoying the scenery. I know it's pretty out there. We can go hiking on Tuesday. With you, I could walk anywhere. California has worn me quite thin. I just can't wait to see you again. Come Monday. Come Monday, I'll be holding you tight. I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. song and that's how we first heard old Jimmy on the radio and this song this song is where you start to realize that there's never going to be another cat like this cat um I even remember me and my friends, that guy tried to put out that song, Sailing. Remember? And everybody was already like, nope. Now Kenny Chesney leans up on it, uh, you know, just does it, straight up does it, you know. And it was such a, well, you know, doesn't straight up do it, but I like Kenny Chesney a lot, mostly because he copies Jimmy Buffett, which is no, no problem at all with me. God, I've already ruined the show by insulting Kenny Chesney. That's not what we came down here to do. God damn. And flip-flops are universal. But the original pirate, you know, uh, the Mark Twain of our time. Uh, and I don't, you know, I don't, I don't have anything to gain by saying these things. I just think they're true. And, as the son of a son of a sailor, I went out on the sea for adventure. Spanning the view with a captain and crew like a man just released from indenture. As a dreamer of dreams and a traveling man, I have chalked up many a mile. I read dozens of books about heroes and crooks And I learned much from both of their styles Son of a son, son of a son Son of a son of a sailor Son of a gun, load the land 
last time One step ahead of the jailer Now we in the near future Southeast of disorder You can shake the hand of a mangled man As he greets you at the border And the lady she hails from Trinidad That's the island of the spices Salt for your meat and cinnamon sweet And the rum is for all your good vices in the sheet as we ride on the wind that our forefathers harness before us. You hear the bells ring as a tide rigger sings. It's a son of a gun of a chorus. Where it all ends, I can't fathom my friends If I knew I might toss out my anchor So I cruise along, always searching for songs Not a lawyer, a thief, or a banker But a son of a son, a son of a son A son of a son of a sailor A son of a gun, blow the last ton one step ahead of the jailer I'm just a son of a son A son of a son A son of a son of a sailor The seas in my veins My tradition remains I'm just glad I don't live in a trailer One time we got to open for Jimmy in um, that place in Ohio. There was 65,000 fucking people there. And I remember when the songs would get over and they would cheer, it would tickle your feet. And I thought, how the fuck do they do this every night, you know? What an amazing thing this cat's built. I'm going to enjoy celebrating these songs. I've known them since I was a kid. Um, disclaimer though, in 1990, even with all the Jerry Jeff and the John and all that, 94 is my cutoff because then I started making my own albums and trying to learn my own songs. But all the ones I learned before that, they're just stuck in there, you know? And, um, and I'm glad I know these and I've been looking forward to playing these for you. My friend, when I was a kid, uh, me and my brother looked up to this guy, Eddie Hallberg. He had, it, it, when he was in sixth grade and I was in third grade, he had a band called the Kings Boys, and they played Louie Louie, and they won the high school thing. He was like a fucking king to me. Then he told me about Saturday Night Live. Then uh, he just, it was always the hip, you know, had the hip shit. And my brother one day said, man, Eddie's got this guy, sings about a cheeseburger. You got to go check it out. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I want to hear a song about a cheeseburger. I rode my bike all the way down there. And then, uh, and then uh, I heard the song, and I just loved it. It was, uh, uh, you had to be there. He played that whole thing. And then me and my best friend, Tim Vall, that was all we fucking gave a fuck about. We were in eighth grade, and we were parrot fucking heads. We both looked like little skateboard dudes and didn't, didn't wear shoes anywhere. And then our parents said we could go see Jimmy doing a show uh, at a smaller play. He was already playing pretty big places, but he was doing a solo show with just Rocket, the steel guy, and a conga guy, and him. And they had the stage look so cool. But I, rem I remember this. Um, there was a shit ton of pot being smoked in there, and we kept running into our teachers, you know? And our teachers were like, we were like, ah, oh, Mr. So-and-so is a badass. And you could tell they were going, ah, oh, Snyder, oh, all right, you know. So <laughs> anyway, to, without further ado, oh, the place that we played together was in Ohio, which is his biggest, uh, 
Isn't that funny? The furthest, the most landlocked city in America is Cincinnati, and that's the place where they absolutely, you just can't get in to see them because it's just amazing. So, all right, without even further ado, let's get the show on the road. this shirt I put together for this fucking thing, huh? I hope you've made some margaritas. And if you've ever busked, if you like to busk, Key West is the bus capital of the world. They have a sunset party at the end of the day. Every day, all the bars close. Everybody just walks down to the end of the pier and watches the sun go down. And if you have a hat and a guitar, or if you're just any kind of busker at all, or if you're thinking about moving here, go there first, man. Fuck around there. It's a lot of fun, right? Meet a million songwriters there, too. And what's that street, Duval? You know? It's weird, because you walk up. It's like second, but it's like you could tell he built this thing. So, well, he didn't build it, but, you know, it, it, his legend grew. So 
you walk up and down Duval and it's like 12 guys like me on any given night kind of you can hear them out on the uh, street you can hear them from walking by and they're telling stories and they're singing songs about their travels and keeping the tradition alive Jimmy told me there was a guy named Gamble Rogers down there before him even that uh, he that Jimmy said he took some some of that I can I found that guy on YouTube though I think that was a generous uh, thing but he was a sailor and he sang let's see what else can we try um oh i love this one uh i would like to try to play harp on them all too um so that would be i'll try the cross harp on this Okay, so I've only done five. I feel like I'm just getting started. I want to go. I want to do mo. This is in G2. I think this is the record after Margaritaville. So uh, Jimmy was cruising along and f filling places before Margaritaville, you know. He was uh, prine-like or something, you know. I remember, you know, I was a kid, but I remember um, the pirate singer, you know, and um, <laughs> and uh, he went to make the record after the big hit, which I think was like his fifth record or whatever. But they went to someplace close to Jonestown and volcanoes, stuff like that. But remember Jonestown? So somewhere near there, I remember Keith saying that was weird. They got, they got to see that site. They traveled all over. And then Keith and 
another one of the guys in the band went to check out the volcano. And when Keith came back, he uh, he had this. And Jimmy uh, Jimmy did, like, I, from what I remember, I know they wrote it together, but there's a bunch of stuff at the end. Keith always says that was Jimmy's, like, you know. Uh, God, I hope I don't, I'm not speaking out of turn. Jimmy, if you're watching this, I love you. I'm doing, I'm trying to get this shit right. <laughs> Let's see. I didn't really practice this. These are just in my DNA, you know. She's moving under me There's a tidal waves out on the sea Sofa spoke up in the sky It'll be pretty soon we'll learn to fly Let me hear you now I don't know, he don't know I don't know, he don't know I don't know where I'm going Now my girl quickly said to me Sit a man, you better to watch your feet She said the lava that come down soft and hot You better lava me now or lava me not Lava said now I don't know He don't know, I don't know I don't know where I'm going to go when the volcano to blow. Mr. Utley. We had no time to count what I'm worth. Because I just left the planet Earth. Hello, where I go, I hope they'll run. Not to worry, see if monsoon come. Said I don't know. I said I don't know. Well, I don't know where I'm gonna go when the volcano blow. I said I don't know. You don't know. Said I don't. I don't want to land in Mexico I don't want to land a new tree mile island I don't want to see my skin a glow I don't want to land in Comanche, Skyport, Garvin, Nashville, Tennessee I don't want to land in our San Juan Airport or the Yukon Territory I don't want to land in no San Diego I don't want to land in no Buzzards Bay I don't want to land on no Ayatollah I got nothing more to say I don't know, I don't know, I don't know where I'm gonna go when the volcano blow. I don't know, I don't know, well, I don't know where I'm gonna go when the volcano blow. songs uh boy the songs you know by heart everybody knows these songs and it's not like jimmy can do any more for me <laughs> but you know usually when i do these tributes i try to i end up gushing over these guys because i just look up to them so much and they created this thing woody guthrie started this thing and ramblin jack took it on the road and and it, there was a time when John Lee Hooker and Ramblin' Jack were the really working that circuit, and they 
influenced so many guys, Jim Croce, Jerry Jeff Walker, Jimmy Buffett, all these um, travel loggers, and uh, I don't know, it just meant a lot to me. Um, here's a good one. Boat drinks, boys in the band, oh, the boat drinks. Visitors just scored on a home ring Everything seems to be wrong Lately I try to live in the affair I gotta fly to sing somewhere I'm close to bodily harm Twenty degrees in the hockey game's on Nobody cares, they are way too far gone Singing boat drinks Something to keep us all warm This morning I shot six holes in my freezer I think I got cabin fever Somebody sound the alarm I'd like Go the I gotta go where the pace of life's slow Won't you be me somewhere, Mr. Spock? Any old place here on Earth or in space You pick the century and I'll pick the spot Oh, I know that I should be leaving this planet I gotta find a new climate I gotta go where it's a warm boat drinks Waitress, I need two more boat drinks Then I'm heading south for my dream shrinks I gotta go where it's a warm I gotta go where it's a warm I gotta go where there ain't any snow Pace of life slow, said, Big sink so low, I said, I gotta go where it's warm. I gotta go where it's warm. Yeah, can you hear that, I bet? The Harleys are coming. Yeah, all right. Well, Ivory Heights, I hope you're feeling warm out there. Hope you're feeling, uh, you know, what is that? Smoke a few joints, make it feel all right. We wanted to do, I'll tell you, one of the reasons we wanted to do these is because last year it was so bittersweet to get to sit and sing some of my friend's songs, so we wanted to just try to do it when it could just be sweet without the bittersweet and um, and just sing songs. I love, I, I know so many songs, and I love these songs. And... Um, <laughs> Sykes wrote this one. Well, I sat there on the coast of Marseille. Thoughts come by like a wind through my hand. How good it be to hold. How good it would be to feel that way again Would you be remembering me? Oh, I ask that question time and again The answer came and haunted me so Yeah. 
had not done what I come to do. I spent all the money I saved. I never did get over you. You make it so That's for Doreen Sykes, you know? <clears throat> All right. I love having not just the helicopter, but the also the, what do you call that? The book finder. How about this shirt, though? I went over to the hip zipper and got this. This says um, something about acid. Man, I'm having a good time. I hope you don't, man, I hope you don't have anything to do because I'm just gonna do this till I can't stop doing it. Sailing again. 
Yesterday's over my shoulder So I can't look back for too long There's too much to see waiting in front of me And I know that I just can't go wrong Amen If the change in attitudes Changes in attitudes Nothing remains quite the same With all of our running and all of our cunning If we couldn't laugh we would all go insane If we weren't all crazy we How's everybody doing out there? Fins to the left, fins to the right. You guys still having fun back there? When I was a kid, this is how we got through winter. Parrot heads, shoulders, knees, and toes. Why just the heads? Why not the shoulders and the knees and the toes? <laughs> Man, if you've never been to a Buffett concert, go. I'm just trying to spew shit off the top of my head, stuff I remember. Um, I just have so many fond memories. One time we got to go play New Year's. I told you that. We'd go play his club for New Year's. His um, niece, Mara, and, and his uh, other niece, um, oh, I'm spacing. Oh, man, she's going to kill me. Uh, uh, and Melanie and Lulu, they're just good friends to me. I went down to Key West that one. Um, I was just talking to Mara the other day about our, my first trip to Key West. She wanted me to see this flower garden took all night to find this thing and then we had to climb over a fence to see it but man i'm going back someday it was like astonishing thing you know and uh yeah man we got to stay in his house i'd never seen a steam shower before he's got a sailboat the fucker can sail too it's got a sail like a big ship you know like with a bunch of shit like uh johnny depp should be standing up there you know, all right, I'll, 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 I'll just sing. I'll just sing shit. I can tell you guys are getting tired of my pontificatings. All right, so check this out. This one goes. And 
now I never ever ever leave you leave you at home all alone and crying tense me a juicy fruit I say a juicy fruit uh, I'm gonna make that last verse I don't know first uh, it says like this Grapefruit, choose the fruit, and I'm going to get it right. Grapefruit, a bathing suit, chew a little juice of fruit, or wash away the night. Yeah, you chew a little juice of fruit. Wash away the night. I blame Brian for that tongue twisting at the end. Why were you trying to sabotage the show like that? Have I, I'm not going too long, am I? I mean, I don't know when I'm going to get to wear this shirt again. Pretty good, though. If you ever go down to Key West, do yourself a favor. Go down to Key West. Go to Louie's Backyard. Sit in, the, sit in the back there. Go see Jimmy's Club. What's that other club we went to where we met that one singer? That's where they said he hung out in the, in the real days. Oh. Also, just to celebrate the whole Key West vibe, we have done acres of cocaine today. <laughs> right? And I have a, a bikini bathing suit on. And actually, it's cold as fuck here. Um, I'm going to keep going until I can't stop. I hope you're enjoying yourself. This will be worth it. Everybody, take a few seconds at home. Keep score. Oh, you know what? Say stuff. Yeah. Say stuff. Tom. Say, damn, Todd, that shirt. It helps us when you say stuff. Yeah. The people at the Spotify like it. Yeah. Is that right? Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Now I'd like to play for you one of the finest songs ever written. There's <laughs> a true story, too. These are pretty much all true stories too. Um. The legend in Key West is that the guy this song is about was a smuggler and uh, he knew he was getting caught and uh, he had this plan for the next time that was gonna happen. He tied a cinder block to his foot to a rope and he jumped out. Yes, I am a pirate 
200 years too late Oh, a cannon don't plunder There ain't nothing to ponder I'm an over 40 victim of fate Life ain't too late Life ain't too late I've done a bit of smuggling I've run my share of grass I've made enough money to buy Miami But I've pissed it away so fast Never meant to last It's never meant to last I have been drunk now for over two weeks I passed out and I rallied and I sprung a few I'm down to rock bottom again Just a few friends Oh, just a few friends I go for younger women I live with several a while And go around them away They all come back someday And they still seem to manage a smile just takes a while It just takes a while Mother, mother ocean After all the years I've found My occupation No hazard being that my occupation Just not around I feel like I'm Tell you, man, when he made that Fruitcakes record, or uh, he let me go with him. And he, uh, funny, I have, I have, I have so much reverence for this guy. He taught me to breathe. How that, how's that? That's something. I really did. And uh, you know, I don't see him as much as I used to. I want to send this whole show out to him and his family and Michael Ramos and and uh, uh, shit everybody Utley well now they're making movies no black and white with happy endings where nobody fights so if you find yourself in that nostalgic rage hey honey jump right up Show your age Well, I wish I had a pencil in my stash The Boston Blackie kind I had a two-tone Ricky Ricardo jacket And an autographed picture of Andy Devine I said I remember being buck-toothed and skinny Writing fan letters to Sky's knees penny Oh, I wish I had a pencil thin mustache Then I could saw some cruise into But, well, it's bandstand Disneyland Growing up fast Drinking on a fake ID 
The rama of the jungle was everyone's piranha, but only jazz musicians were smoking marijuana. Yeah, I wish I had a pencil thin mustache, then I could solve some mysteries too. Then it's flat pop, dirty cop, cop in the field, a grubbing on the living room floor. So, so, well, they send you off to college to gain a little knowledge. But all you want to do is learn how to score. I said, now I am old, I don't wear underwear. I don't go to church and I don't cut my hair. But I can go to movies and see it all there Just the way that it used to be That's why I wish I had a pencil in my stash The Boston Blackie kind I had a two-tone Ricky Ricardo jacket And an autographed picture of Andy Devine I could be anyone I wanted to be Maybe Suave Errol Flynn Or the Sheik of be If I only had a pencil thin mustache Then I could do some cruising too A yeah, brill cream A little dabble do you Oh, I could do some cruising too I don't wanna stop having such a good time. Are you with me out there? <sighs> Snyder, you were born to do this Buffett stuff. <laughs> I'm whomping Chesney at it. No question. No question. <laughs> I'm as salty as you get, man. Hold on. Saturday. 
Will you, I'm going to play one. Now we're in the wing it part. Will you see if you can find, um, I had it a second ago. I'm going to do this and when. play um, Spider John. That was a Willis Allen Ramsey song, but Jimmy recorded that song. Um. Hey, I can't do that. In between Fritz and the show. That's, that's tough. That's tough. All right. That's all right. I'm trying to think of some more. I might know there's got to be some more. I'm not ready to stop. How long have we been going? Okay, okay. I know I know more. If I can, well, I'll take a few puffs and we'll do an encore. Yeah, yeah. This is just songs I know by heart. sponge cake watching the sun beat all of those two rays covered with oil strumming my sixth string on my front porch swing the smell of the shrimp they're beginning to boil Wasted away again in Margaritaville but Searching for my long shaker song Some people claim that there's a woman to blame But I know it's my own damn Nothing for sure but this brand new tattoo She's a real beauty A Mexican cutie How she got here, Lord, I haven't a clue Help me sing at home 
gonna say I am Wasted away again in Margaritaville Searching for my long shaker of salt Some people claim that there's a bomb on the plane It's my own damn fault I blew up my flip-flop I stepped on a pop-top I broke my leg I had to cruise on back home God, I still feel pain I wish I had some cocaine that's been gone since early this morning Wasted away again in Margaritaville Searching for my lost shaker song Some people claim that there is a one Lord, it's all my fault Yet I know Lord, it's all of my fault Y'all, thank you for tuning in and helping us beat this cold I hope you had a good time I know I had a really great time playing these songs Thank you, Jimmy Buffett, for Bringing this pirate rock and roll into our lives Fins to the left.
Digging it. Thank you for turning into this Caribbean celebration of the great Mark Twain of the sea. What a generous man. Nobody's been kinder to me. He introduced me to Bob Mercer, who uh, completely uh, guided me through this, this troubadour thing. Uh, right up to and through now. And I wouldn't have done it without Jimmy and his generosity. I'm one of many, um, many people that have been affected by his generosity. And I tell you, I was, I was telling the guys, my best story that I have in music, period, is um, for, for the first time I met Jimmy, Keith Sykes and I were driving around up here, and I had just been offered a contract with Capitol Records. And Jimmy saw Keith in the car, and they honked at each other, and then they pulled in to get um, lunch. And Jimmy's telling Keith how he's starting a label, and Keith's telling Jimmy how he just got me signed to one, and that's how we met. And then it wasn't six months before I fucked that up. I, I used to drink a lot. I mean, I still do, but I used to, too, as the great... Well, I don't drink. I just cuts into my hard drugs. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but my point is, um, so then I didn't see him. I got fired from that label, and then um, uh, Mercer, I was playing here in Nashville, and Bob Mercer and Mike Utley came to see their friend Keith Sykes, but they liked me, and they said, yeah, let's take him to Jimmy. And, and uh, so they called Jimmy, and Jimmy said, I shit you not, we'll bring him out to the Greek theater. We're playing there tomorrow. He can open, and if I like him, we'll let him make an album. So I flew out there, and I played my um, set, and uh, he was standing there with Joe Walsh and, and, um, and uh, that country singer. And he asked me if I wanted to make records, and of course I did, especially for him, you know. Um, and... And then the next day, we were going to go play. He said I could come play Portland. That was my hometown. And uh, he said, uh, hey, man, I'm going to look at a plane. He still has this plane. It's like called a Grumman or something. Because I want to look at this plane. You want to come with me? I'm like, yes. And um, I still can't believe it. Him and Keith uh, were working on a song in the car. And then we get out to this a seaplane, a big, huge, weird-looking seaplane. And he flew it. We got in there and he flew it to Seattle and landed it in the water, you know? And then just went over and knocked out about 80,000 fucking people. So I'm gonna, I, I'm just getting in the mood here. Um, she's a rail. Wait, no, that's not. The keys, that's the hard thing to remember. What key is it in? Those keys he does them in isn't necessarily the ones I can do them in, you know. This is a song he wrote with Jerry Jeff Walker. They were um, going on a train. It was the last run of a certain train, and they wanted to be on it. And in their car, they made up this song. She's a railroad lady, just a little bit shady. She spent a whole life on them trains. She's a summer good looker, but the fast trails they took her. And now she's trying, just trying to get home again. South Station in Boston to the freight yards of Boston. Florida the sunshine to the New Orleans rain. And now that the rail bikes have taken all the best tracks. She's trying, just trying to get home again. She's a railroad lady, just a little bit shady. Spent a whole life on a train. She's a semi good looker, but the fast trails that took her. She's trying, just trying to get home again. A poor man caught traveler Now the switch men won't have her Is she trying, just trying To get home again Oh 
There was a highballing owner, he thought he could own her. He bought her a fur coat and a big diamond ring. She hocked down for cold cash, left town on the wall bash, not thinking, never thinking of home way back then. Now the rails are all rusty and the dining car's dusty And gold-plated watches have taken their toll For the railroads are dying and the lady sits crying On a bus to Kentucky now and a home that's her goal She's a railroad lady, just a little bit shady Spent her whole life on them Fast trails that took her And now she's trying, just trying To get on again She's trying, just trying To get on again Yeah This next one, I just can't stop I want to sing this one This reminds me of his niece, Mara I hope she's listening, Mara I think this is her favorite one we both felt like we connected to this girl in this song. Um, yeah, I'll do this for you. Standing by the side of a highway for exit I saw a lady in a tie-dye with a bag by her side Not really looking like anything special She saw my Tennessee tags and she waved for a ride She sat right beside me as the meter hit 60 Explaining her travels and her family background when she got through, I could not help but thinking She's a long way from a West Nashville Grand Ballroom now She's a long way from a West Nashville Grand Ballroom now Father had money and mother had love A channel entirely to her dear sister Doug 22 years in society's plan Canceled at the swing of her dear mother's hand Six hours later we hit Cincinnati Yawning she woke up and that's where we were When she found out she said I must be going this close to Nashville was too close for her So I stopped by the roadside and I gave her five dollars She took it and she kissed me and she gave me a note She told me I could read it if I mailed it in Nashville On old loose leaf paper to her mother she wrote said, Mama, I'm fine if you happen to wonder. I don't have much money, but I still get it around. I haven't been church in near 36 Sundays. So fuck all those West Nashville Grand Ballroom gowns. She's a long way from a West Nashville Grand Ballroom gowns. She's a long way from a West Nashville Grand
streets are dusty and the bank has been torn down. It's a dying little town. Well, the church window's broken. That place loaded ain't been used in years. The jail don't have a sheriff or a cell. The electric trains bum by maybe once a month. I'm fucking the shit up out of this I thought I could get this Oh man, I did so good Ring, ring, ring Slipping away Only 40 people Living on their day Cause the street's dusty And the bank has been torn down it's a dying little town. This is why I want to do this. It says, It across from the bar, there's a pile of beer cans. Been there 27 years. Imagine all the heartaches and tears in 27 years of beers. So we hop back in the rental car and we hit the cruise control. But pretty soon the town was out of sight But we left behind a fat bar made A cowboy and a dog Racing for Wrangling Saturday night Wrangling one up real bad but who else gets up here and you know anybody could come up here and do shit they knew all right i can't stop though i'm gonna do this one i better quit while i'm ahead y'all i love you so deeply so deeply with all my heart and i hope that we can stick together through these tumultuous times no, thanks for giving us something to do. It's just been the one, two, three, four, five of us all year, so. Can I do one more? Of course. Okay. Oh, they 
I don't think any paradise out there for tuning in tonight and helped us get through this cold night. And thank anybody else that tuned in. Thank you for giving us your Monday evening. And we'll see you again on Sunday with the same old service. Coral Reefers, you... Ghost. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.